All right, we're looking at a Sig Sauer Romeo 4, red dot. I'm gonna make this pretty quick, as in like just a few minutes. I hate when I get on YouTube looking for something and they spend the first two minutes, hey YouTube, this is tactical death SWAT dealer, but like skip, 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 skip. Is it good, is it worth the money? That's all, I'm trying to do that. Uh, yeah, this is good, I'd say it's worth the money. Speaking of that, I think it was 300 or so, uh, I think. Um, anyways, a couple hundred bucks. It's worth it. Six Sour Romeo 4. Alright. That's what it looks like. Just a couple features. Just like most of these red dots. Constant eye relief. Parallax free. It's got a 2 MOA dot. And it's got two different reticles. You just switch between them by holding these buttons down. It came pretty much sighted in right out of the box. I didn't do anything to it as far as adjusting it, and it's hit everything. I put it on target. So uh, it's got a quick detach mount. It comes with a riser, so it can co-witness with the front sight, or a one-third co-witness as well, whatever. I don't use any of that stuff. I just snapped it on my gun, and it was good to go right away. Um, one thing I will say, it claims that it's motion activated, and... So as soon as it detects motion, it'll cut on. And then when it doesn't detect, it'll cut off. That is yet to happen either way. Uh, has not, I've had to turn it on myself every single time, which is whatever. I don't care. It's not a huge deal to me, but it might be a huge deal to somebody. They got a lifetime warranty on them. They're waterproof. You know, like a billion battery life hours on it. It's something crazy. Uh, they have like three different models of these. Four A, B, and C. Uh, Hell, I don't even know. I can't remember which one this one is, to be honest with you. I know it's not the C. That one's solar powered. But whatever. So, I'll turn it on, see if you can get an uh, image of what it looks like. Yeah, I know that's super blurry, but that's the dot, and you can change it to a... Uh, trying to get the ring around it but I'm trying to hold a phone in one hand and do this with the other just one second let's see okay maybe the other one had it. I know it's really blurry can't really see it that well anyways y'all know what a red dot looks like I'm not doing this to show you what a dot a red dot looks like but I'm just saying overall it's a good product okay uh, the motion thing see look they claim if you do that, it's supposed to cut on automatically. It doesn't. Um, and then when it sits still, it'll shut itself off. Like I said, none of those two things have happened since I've had it, but I mean, it's not that big deal to me. It's got the little covers on there. Um, it's I'll, My favorite thing about it is how quick it mounts onto the, on my AR. I mean, it snapped on like two seconds. And, you know, I took it out of the box, snapped it on, it was immediately hitting on target. Within... 30 seconds of owning it can't beat that it's a good option so you don't have to spend hundreds and hundreds and hundreds or even a thousand dollar on an optic so there it is i would i would get it if you had the chance that's my first red dot i've had i love it i don't plan on getting another one so maybe that'll help give you some info if you got any questions about it I, i'm not doing all the detailed stuff on it i'm just a regular guy just some guy you know i don't know all the specs on everything I don't claim to but if you have a question about it just let me know i'll get it answered for you appreciate you